Here we are, we're in North Carolina looking at a 33 acre property that is not yet on the market and also meeting a, a new realtor. We met Brandon through some networking that we've been doing with some other folks and this is a property that he is just now speaking with the owner. So Brandon wanted to see what we liked about it, what we didn't like about it, so kind of to help him as he's talking to folks that are getting ready to start listing their properties and maybe they're not on the market yet. So we're kind of getting a preview of this. We were definitely excited to come take a look and see what it had to offer. I'll give you the lay of the land here. Okay. Um, goes to the creek here, which is just amazing. Yeah, the creek looks beautiful. Yeah. Um, and the creek frontage. Okay. And actually, right, oh, there's a lot of creek frontage. I didn't realize we drove on the road and between out where the property ends and it didn't seem like it would go that far from the 35 acres but mm -hmm. I think the way it's sliced out okay hopefully we can walk it um, so a lot of it hill but there is a good amount of flat down here how many acres do you think of flat there is um, minus the two that you were hooked at yeah, just up here. I don't know, probably a couple acres, uh, maybe more. I mean, you can just walk in there and kind of see. Is this house on it? Yeah, this is the house. Okay. Um, so. Oh, it's got some daffodils. Yeah, daffodils. Oh, <laughs> maybe even some inside the table. <laughs> Little planter so, already established for us. Here and it's it is, like, if you look on the map, it doesn't seem like it's that private. For one, this is not a very busy road, but yeah. you, you get in here and, you know, you're not, there's no eyes on you, uh -huh. you know. Yeah. Um, and my thought, if I was going to make this my homestead, is, you know, you would clear all this right in here. You know, leave definitely a good tree line and maybe plant more um, evergreens and, you mm -hmm. know, there's... There's a lot of good options for trees um, to give a good green barrier. But you want your animals closer to your homestead. You don't want them way out, you know. Um, it's definitely more of an issue on the west coast of mountain lions. But I'm, I'm going to go ahead and assume that it's not habitable. It's not, but it's not that far off. It is, I think it looks worse. And it is, I mean, you could, you could make this home livable. It's locked. Um, I don't have the key, but okay. he, I looked in it the other day and, you know, it's not falling down. It's, you know, it would need full remodel. But it's just more overgrown. It's overgrown. You know, I mean, it's not going to be a, a mansion and it's not going to be like, but that would be the bathroom, I guess. Um, Oh yeah. Outdoor shower. That's what I was wondering. Is that legitimately the out I think that's the, the and then the wall just came down on it, or I think they were remodeling it and they stopped. Okay. Yeah. That's new. You know, gotta have a little vision. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I just think, man, if you guys pull up your RV and you can stay in that, you guys have that, and you can work on this place. You guys want to go down to the the creek frontage first? Sure. Or? Yeah. There's a bottle in here, but it doesn't look broken. Is it nice and chilly? Yeah, it is. <laughs> it would hurt to get in. Yeah. <laughs> Do a nice polar plunge, lay down in it. I love the size of a creek though. Like, this is great. This is beautiful. I was going to run up here real okay, quick. Okay, we're going to continue down that way. Sure, that way. I'll catch up with you guys. Yeah. Okay.
So this is an old logging road, but it's washed out. The other logging roads are not. Not as bad? No, not, a, not even close to this. Yeah, I went up this way, like where he is. Oh. And then I looked up here, but I didn't actually walk up here. I'll take the dog. So this portion of the logging trail is pretty simple to make good again. Yeah. It doesn't look like there's very much old growth. It looks like it's, all, it's been logged semi-recently, like within the last 10 years. Could be. Oops. Down there. Watch out. I'm watching your crazy whipping. Yeah, I'm not holding them back. Yep. Hi guys. Are you having fun? Is this so much better? Yeah, and then we walked up, Thanks. up there, and we walked the, the spring. It just goes, it follows these boulders oh, all the way up. There's lots of little pockets and stuff. Okay. But then you have this clear, this area, and then it goes straight down to the river, huh. right down there. Come here, Floyd. Go ahead, Kinsley. Get in the river. Go on. Go ahead. better? you feel better now? Um, so I think it was what 35 acres? About 35 acres, yeah. yeah. And most of it's up on a hill. It does have a very nice creek at the bottom. It's a very beautiful creek. Yes. I really like it. Yep. That was very nice but it does take a bit to get down there. Yes. Yeah. Not directly accessible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's not a lot of flat land. Brandon, um, the one that we just walked with, he thinks there's probably about two acres of land where, where the house is that is mm. flattish. So, Out of 35. Out of the 35. They're asking 300000 for it. Mm. It does have an old house that needs to be rehabilitated. It has a workshop, but the owner wants to keep it. Yep. So... And we, he doesn't know the situation with all of the vehicles because there's over... 30 vehicles and at least four boats that we've come across yeah. and walking um, all over the property. So not sure if those come with the property, if he's going to be moving those. So again, just cost and associated. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And those little things like that's not the biggest issue. It's just a, it was, it, it didn't seem private. No. Um, and Maybe for our, for my lack of knowledge, I'm not sure how I would best use the land. Mm. Yeah, it's, what would you say, a 20 to 30% incline? If you follow the logging trails, yes. Mm -hmm. But if you go off the logging trails, it's steeper. It's very steep, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Like just going around the logging trails, if you look down to go to the creek, it was probably an 80%. Mm -hmm. 
Um, yeah, it was steep. It was very steep. Yeah. So not quite sure how we would use it for our intents and purposes. Um, yeah. And he thought it was logged actually 40 years ago, which hmm. must have some very slow growth trees because the majority of the trees are only a couple inches in diameter. So pretty, not a lot of usable timber either mm -hmm. to rebuild if we weren't going to get the shop and the house needs repairs. Mm -hmm. We definitely were able to give the pros and cons of the property of what we really liked about it and what we really didn't like about it and what we were kind of willing to compromise on. Mm -hmm. So I think hopefully that's helpful in the next ones that they come across just to kind of see um, a little bit more what we're looking for. Yep. On to the next. Bye.